I'm Doug with Jerky.com, and today in our test kitchen, we're making jerky with a classic hot sauce. We're making Cholula beef jerky. All right, we're gonna start with two pounds of eye of round. If you don't know, I keep all this pre-sliced and pre-measured in two pound bags in my freezer. That way, when we go to make jerky, everything's pre-cut, I don't have to mess around. All right, so we're gonna start with half a cup of Cholula, quarter cup of rice vinegar, doing minced garlic, brown sugar, granulated garlic, powdered onion, onion powder, and then black pepper and salt. If you want all this recipe, there's gonna be a link in the description. Go over to our blog. We got everything fully listed for you there. Now, every time you're messing with uh, pre-sliced meat, I always take extra caution to peel it all apart. If you don't, it ends up sticking together and you don't get proper coverage over everything. So everything gets covered. Super important. Just keep mixing that stuff thoroughly. Again, you want even coverage. By the time you're done, there should be consistency in color. That way you know the meat's taking everything. That's a really good indication of how well you're mixing. Mix that stuff up thoroughly. I feel like this is really pretty good. So I'm gonna wash my hands. Then all that's left, seal that up tight, throw it in the fridge. All right, the Cholula has been marinating now for uh, almost two full days, 43, 44 hours. Uh, it's got a really good color, really good texture. Smells phenomenal. So we're just gonna lay this out, make sure there's plenty of space for the air to flow all around. Try not to make it so that any of the pieces are touching. We got plenty of space in our dehydrator. This is a six tray dehydrator, which you usually do about, depending, maybe four or five pounds. So we're only doing two pounds of meat here, so we got plenty of tray space. So I don't have to worry too much about tetracizing and maximizing what goes on. And if you see any fat hanging off, go ahead, feel free, trim that stuff off or leave it. You know, I don't mind a little bit of fat, but stuff that hangs off like that, that just kind of gets a mess to tray and untray. And three trays is it. All right, now we're gonna fire this dehydrator up. Set your time of temperature for your desired texture. On this machine, I know it's about 140 degrees is what I like. And then I set it for about four and a half hours and I start checking regularly. I expect this to be somewhere between four and a half, maybe five and a half hours tops. This stuff smells phenomenal. It has a really good texture, little on the dry side for my liking, but it looks really good on the inside. Let's give this one a try. This one is really good. Mild heat, I'd say maybe a five, maybe a six tops. Great flavor. If you like the flavor of hot sauce, especially Cholula, give this one a try. It's very easy to make. I promise you won't be let down. This one's been a really fun one to make. If you enjoyed this video, you got any value of it whatsoever, would you please like and subscribe to our channel? Who knows, maybe we'll make your flavor in our next recipe. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time in the jerky.com test kitchen.